This video is brought to you by PayPal, helping you seize the season when holiday gift inspiration strikes. Shop the globe today. This is it. Don't get scared now. Welcome to WatchMojo.com, and today we're counting down our picks for the top 10 home alone traps. Be a good little fella now and open the door. Before we begin, we publish new videos every day, so be sure to subscribe for more great content. For this list, we're looking at the most creative ways Kevin McAllister has foiled the wet bandits, from playing tricks to borderline guerrilla warfare tactics that put Harry and Marv through the ringer. Hey, do you guys give up? Have you had enough pain? Never! Number 10, Rope Burn, Home Alone 2, Lost in New York. Sometimes the most obvious pain is the best option. After finally getting to the top of the house, Harry and Marv find out that Kevin is already on the ground and chase him down a rope. What they don't know is that the rope is soaked in kerosene, which Kevin is quick to light when the pair are halfway down. What makes this trap great is the length the bandits go to to avoid the fire, letting go and falling several stories in the process. The final punishment comes when a barrage of paint cans follow them down, dousing them in cold water. <laughs> Number 9. Orna Mental, Home Alone What do Marv and John McClane have in common? A real need for shoes. After Kevin's tar trap forces Marv to lose his footwear, the bandit decides to sneak in through the window. Unfortunately, he forgets to look before he leaps and plunges his feet down on some easily shattered Christmas ornaments. <laughs> the trap works as a double whammy when Marv's initial reaction from the pain forces him to step on more ornaments just to keep moving. A testament to Kevin's style, the ornament trap manages to harm the wet bandits while tying in to the spirit of Christmas. Where the hell did you take your shoes off? Why the hell are you dressed like a chicken? Number 8. Too Hot to Handle, Home Alone Just like in marketing, when it comes to setting traps, it's all about branding. When Harry finally forces his way up the McAllister's front steps, he's all too smug to notice the tiny details right under his nose. As he goes to open the door, he misses the doorknob's orange glow and grabs it for the shock, or in this case burn, of his life. He quickly crawls back down the steps and throws his hand in the snow to cool it down. When he pulls it out, he discovers the family's M branded right into his hand. The mark even follows him to the sequel, making it the only trap to permanently damage him. Yes! 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 Number 7. Tool Time, Home Alone 2, Lost in New York When the bandits go up against gravity, gravity always wins. After a very brief respite, Harry and Marv hear a thumping noise from behind a door. Wondering what's causing the sound, the two press their ears up to the door as it cuts to a tool cabinet tumbling towards them. The fear in their faces before the door bursts open is the cherry on top, before the chest pushes them across the floor. Their noses may be broken, but at least Marv correctly identifies what the sound is. That was the sound of a tool chest. Number six. On Ice, Home Alone. That's one way to give someone the slip. For his first trick, Kevin hoses his staircases, turning them into a traction nightmare. When Marv heads for the basement door, the slippery steps practically usher him down, although not in the gentlest way. <laughs> Cleverly using his crowbar to prop himself up, he almost gets inside before slipping again and having it hit him on the head. Harry has it even worse, taking two spills on the front steps, even landing in a backwards roll that would make a gymnast jealous. <laughs> Number 5. What a Hole, Home Alone 2, Lost in New York Once again, Marv's lack of situational awareness leads to his downfall. As he triumphantly enters Kevin's New York hideout, he utters some famous last words and celebrates his hard work. I've reached the top! Excitedly taking his first step in the house, Marv somehow misses the giant pit right in front of him and falls face first to the basement floor below. After bone cracks that sound more like a cement mixer than a human skeleton, Marv finally gets a look at how he ended up downstairs. 
even he has to give Kevin credit for this one. Yeah. Wow. What a hole. Number four, dumb as a doorknob. Home Alone 2, lost in New York. The front door is never a safe way into Kevin McAllister's house, but some people never learn. Waking up from his brick-induced coma, Marv stumbles up the stairs to make his way in. To his confusion, the doorknob pulls out with yards of string attached, which Marv proceeds to unravel. Turning around to give the string a hearty yank, Marv is shot in the butt by a jury-rigged staple gun. Thanks to Kevin's brilliant engineering, the gun shoots him the more he squirms in pain, and each staple is more painful than the last. Oh! Number three, paint it black and blue. Home Alone 2, lost in New York. Why don't you guys try the stairs? Right. While some people learn from their mistakes, sometimes it's still not enough. When climbing the staircase in Kevin's fortified New York house, the bandits suddenly remember their unfortunate paint can attack from the last Christmas raid and adapt accordingly. Oh! He busted me right in my mouth, Marv! As Kevin proceeds to aimlessly throw the cans at them, the pair can barely keep it together, believing they've actually outsmarted him. But then, Kevin reveals his true trap, a giant metal column that swings down, knocking them all the way to the basement. Oops. Kevin's sadistic nature takes it one step further as he cuts the column loose to let it hit the bandits one last time. No. Number two, that's sinking feeling. Home Alone 2, lost in New York. Even by Home Alone standards, this trap is pretty electrifying. When Marv tries to wash off the paint from Kevin's previous trap, his choice of sink couldn't have been worse. As he grabs the faucets, Kevin activates an arc welder connected to the sink. Marv's screams get wilder and wilder as Kevin cranks up the juice, puffing out Marv's hair and even turning him into a cartoonish skeleton. As dark as the trap is, it's hard not to laugh as Marv keeps shaking, even after he lets go of the faucets. Before we unveil our number one pick, here are some honorable mentions. No, you're dead! Number one, baptism by fire, home alone. Deciding to avoid continued burns from the heated front door, Harry goes around back to enter through the kitchen, going out of the frying pan and into the fire, literally. Harry's burst through the door activates a blowtorch that sets his head on fire and gives us this timeless reaction. While he manages to put it out with snow the first time, his attempt to extinguish it with toilet bowl water in New York ends with explosive results thanks to some kerosene. <laughs> and yet through it all, the famously foul-mouthed Joe Pesci manages to keep himself from cursing. Now that's acting. <laughs> This video has been brought to you by PayPal. This holiday, seize the season at millions of online retailers. Shop the globe today. Do you agree with our picks? Check out these other great clips from WatchMojo and subscribe for new videos every day.